This video is about air arthrogram and injection of the hip joint. I am Dr. Anil Kumar, consultant specialist orthopedic surgeon. This is a 48 year old patient with history of avascular necrosis of the left hip femoral head had undone core decompression and fibula autograph three years ago. Presented with increased pain and stiffness of the left hip, X-rays revealed moderate osteoarthritis with mild collapse of the femoral weight-bearing surface. Needed pain relief for a few months before he considered to consent for left hip air arthrogram and steroid injection under CM fluoroscopic guidance. Patient is placed on radiolucent surgical table. Intravenous sedation is given, draped after thorough cleaning of the skin. I am palpating the tip of the greater trochanter. The spinal needle is placed over the drape just proximal to greater trochanter and needle trajectory confirmed under fluoroscopic guidance. One percent xylocaine injected locally to skin, subcutaneous tissue, fascia and muscles and hip capsule. Air arthrogram is performed first by injecting approximately 5 to 6 cc of air, you can clearly see the immediate radiolucent illumination around the head and neck, especially seen at the inferior joint cavity. You can clearly see the difference between the pre and post air arthrogram. This confirms the tip of the needle is inside the joint cavity. During this injection procedure, always try to keep the hip joint internally rotated so that anterior capsule and ligaments will be relaxed and more fluid will be pushed anteriorly. Approximately 68 cc clear slightly blood stained cyanobal fluid was aspirated uh, due to effusion in the osteoarthritic hip joint. A second 6 cc air uh, bubble injected, you can s clearly see the immediate radiolucent illumination around the head and neck especially seen at the inferior joint cavity. This again will confirm the tip of the needle is inside the hip joint cavity. A mixture of 6 cc of marcaine and 40 mg of dapometrol was injected through the spinal needle. With successful injection, patient will have immediate pain relief within few minutes. These are the C arm fluoroscopic images taken at the time of the air arthrogram and injection procedure. You can clearly see the images before and after the air arthrogram. Air arthrogram will help to avoid injecting um, iodine based uh, radio opaque contrast and hence prevent his complications such as aller severe allergic reactions as well as iodine induced synovitis. Studies have shown that the air arthrogram injection procedure is as successful as iodine based contrast injection procedures with less complications. Like this video, please subscribe and share. Thank you very much for watching this video.